Well, for the past year, students at the University of South Dakota have been fighting food insecurity on campus through Charlie's Cupboard. Today, they're preparing for their first food giveaway of the semester. Kevin Lance Lauren Solik was there to learn how the program has grown. It's been a year since Charlie's Cupboard opened on the University of South Dakota campus, and in that year, they've been able to expand from this small room to this larger room offering more products to USD students. I've been with Charlie's Cupboard since the ribbon cutting one year ago today, um, and watching us go from literally a closet to a room that's three times as big, um, it's amazing to see. We've got a fridge, we've got a freezer now. We're able to offer those diverse products to students as well. And they've expanded the items they offered to more than just food. This last summer, we um, recently started purchasing more hygiene products for students, um, still focusing on food insecurity, but also um, kind of taking a look at the other aspect of student life that sometimes students struggle with. Charlie's Cupboard is a student-ran initiative that's served over a thousand students in its first year. I think it brings light to a mostly um, invisible um, situation that some of our students experience. So um, food insecurity is something that we don't see on a day-to-day -day basis and it can be something that's not necessarily talked about until maybe someone is in a dire situation. And Charlie's Cupboard is a really good opportunity to one, destig destigmatize food insecurity within student populations, but also provide support before students start to feel like they're unsupported. In Vermilion, Lauren Solick, Kelloland News. Charlie's Cupboard is open every second and third Thursday of the month from 4 to 7 p.m. If you'd like to donate to Charlie's Cupboard, we posted information on Kelloland.com.